Has the red giant Beetlejuice exploded into a supernova without us even knowing? Discover the stunning revelation that could illuminate our night sky. Brace yourself for an astronomical revelation. A team of scientists claim that Betelgeuse, the stunning red supergiant gracing Orion's shoulder, has already detonated. Yes, you've heard it right, and this is no joke. Within the upcoming decade or so, its dazzling aftermath is set to brighten our night sky. But how did researchers arrive at this extraordinary claim? Should we be alarmed? Can the James Webb Space Telescope capture Betelgeuse's remnants? Today, we're delving into these captivating questions. One of the most easily spotted stars in the northern hemisphere's winter night sky is Betelgeuse, the red supergiant. Among a select few, it shines with such brilliance that its reddish-orange hue can be spotted with the naked eye. Betelgeuse typically ranks as the tenth brightest star in the night sky, yet it is known for varying in brightness. This is largely due to its massive size and nature. If we could hypothetically replace our sun with Betelgeuse, it would extend all the way to the asteroid belt, boasting a mass about 20 times that of the sun. Surprisingly, Betelgeuse is quite youthful for a star, with an estimated age of 8 to 10 million years. In comparison, our sun is significantly older at about 4.6 billion years. Supergiant stars like Betelgeuse consume their nuclear fuel rapidly and go supernova relatively quickly on geological timescales, causing them to evolve rapidly. Betelgeuse, it seems, may have done just that before our very eyes. To comprehend how researchers arrived at the conclusion that Betelgeuse had already exploded, it's essential to delve into its history. The intriguing story of Betelgeuse begins around the 2nd century BCE, when Chinese astronomers observed it exhibiting a distinct yellow hue. Fast forward to the mid-2nd century AD, Greco-Roman astronomer Ptolemy described it as orangish or ruddy, much like we see it today. There's a plausible physical theory that Chinese astronomers witnessed Betelgeuse during its yellow supergiant phase, and over several centuries, it transitioned into the red supergiant phase. This would imply that humans worldwide, who have always been night sky watchers, noticed this change but left no records. Imagine them, gazing up at the night sky, wondering, wasn't that star brighter once? Indeed, this is precisely what's been happening recently. Betelgeuse, known to be a variable star, had its brightness unnaturally dip by a substantial amount starting in December 2019. This dip was visibly noticeable to those familiar with the star, marking a deviation from its normal behavior until early 2020. Observations made by the Hubble Space Telescope suggested that Betelgeuse had ejected a tremendous amount of scorching material into space, forming an extensive dust cloud. This cloud obscured a significant portion of the star's light when viewed from our vantage point, resulting in a remarkable transformation. Betelgeuse, once among the ten brightest stars, faded until it ranked lower than the twentieth brightest. This puzzling dimming was in stark contrast to its neighboring star, Aldebaran, which holds the fourteenth position in terms of brightness. Thankfully, Betelgeuse showed signs of recovery. But... Its atypical behavior didn't stop there. In fact, over the past few months, it has exhibited an unusual increase in brightness, surpassing its normal luminosity by a staggering 50. This puzzling brightness fluctuation is quite unsettling for a star known for its regular changes. So what's behind the erratic behavior? A widely debated conservative hypothesis suggests that Betelgeuse is nearing its supernova phase. While conservative estimates still propose that the star is approximately 100,000 years away from its supernova event, we will present evidence today questioning this idea and suggesting that it has already happened. According to a groundbreaking recent scientific paper by Hideyuki Sayo and colleagues of the Tohoku University in Japan, Betelgeuse has already undergone a supernova explosion and we may witness the aftermath of this cosmic spectacle within a decade or few from now. But Betelgeuse's story doesn't stop here. 
there's still a puzzle to solve regarding conflicting observations about the ejection of materials and the star's subsequent recovery. While most lean towards a mass ejection event, it's also a possibility that our estimates for Betelgeuse's explosion timing could be off. This enigmatic star is also tricky to observe since it has slipped behind the sun and won't be visible again until at least August. However, Betelgeuse's immense size and relatively close proximity allow us to resolve a disk when observing it, offering a rare opportunity to capture direct variations in its light output through photography. Let's delve into a hypothetical scenario where Betelgeuse has indeed gone supernova. First and foremost, it's going to be a magnificent spectacle. And don't worry, it's perfectly safe for us here on Earth. Although it won't be the brightest object in the sky, it would definitely cast its own shadows at night and remain visible during the daytime for about a year. What about the James Webb Space Telescope, JOST? Could it have observed Betelgeuse's remnants? Spoiler alert! Unfortunately, Betelgeuse is too bright for the JOST to observe without damaging its detectors. But fear not, plenty of other observatories both on the ground and in space, eagerly await the chance to capture the cosmic spectacle. So, what remains after a supernova explosion? It could either collapse into a neutron star, or, if there's enough material, transform into a black hole. Both scenarios are rare and especially intriguing considering Betelgeuse's proximity. We can't say for certain that Betelgeuse is on the brink of a supernova. Its surface doesn't reveal what's happening deep within its core. It's certainly unstable at the moment, but could return to its normal cycles and remain that way for decades or even centuries. Despite being close to a supernova, alternative models suggest that the explosion might not occur for tens of thousands of years. Ultimately, only time will reveal the true fate of Betelgeuse. This celestial spectacle serves as a stark reminder that the night sky is ever-changing and stars are not eternal. While some endure for unimaginable sands of time, the universe constantly evolves. So, let's continue to marvel at the wonders of the cosmos and embrace the mysteries that lie within. Thank you for watching. We appreciate your support and would love for you to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and share your thoughts in the comments below.